và cái răng nó tươi vậy lắm Hello. Hello. Welcome to support your last stream showroom. This this is Chandler. And this is Liwi. Mm -hmm. And and Liwi, what are we going to introduce today? Tonight, actually, for me. Mm -hmm. Today we are tonight we are going to introduce our one of our you know been to cup coffee machine, which is name is Aurora. Aurora. Yes. Just sounds like a, a scream of the lion, right? <laughs> you guess so. Okay, uh -huh. do you know uh, what is the name from Aurora? I guess it's from some country uh, from European. <laughs> yes, it is. You are so smart. Actually, which country? It's from Italy, you know. Ah, I see. And do you know why? Because uh, this machine, for the most of the part, are, mm -hmm. we are imported from Italy. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's why we name it as... Aurora. Yes, it okay. is. Okay, so we will start from the outside appearance, uh, okay? Okay, no problem. As we can see here, it's a mm -hmm. big glass, big black tempered glass right here. Oh, okay, let me check. Wow, it's strong, you know? It's very strong yeah. and it's very hard. Mm -hmm. Does your hand hurt? It hurt. Yeah, it hurt my hand. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, it's a tempered glass mm -hmm. right here. So we make the you know mm -hmm. the front more in our strength. Yeah. And okay, as we can see here, is with the small blue screen right here, right? Yes. Actually, this small blue screen is for us to check the uh, machine information. Or when you dispense uh, like uh, some kind of drinks, it mm -hmm. will show what kind of drinks you are you are you are making, mm -hmm. and also uh, you can check the machine configuration when you enter into some setting mode. Yes, exactly. Mm -hmm. As we can see here, if you can close enough, huh? <laughs> I'm not sure. I think it's, it's it's a small dots. And you mean these small dots? I I guess they cannot see that clearly. <laughs> okay. Yeah, one. Two, three dots. Yes, actually, there are three dots here. And what does this dots for? Uh, actually, uh, you see, there are three dots, right? Yeah. And uh, in the left side, there's one small dot. This yeah. is for uh, this is the mode button. Actually, uh, when you uh, enter into the mode setting uh, mode, and you can press this to change to different uh, item or different uh, uh, number you, you want to set mm -hmm. and you see these two small dots is minus and, and plus uh, buttons which for you to adjust the number of that uh, setting yes yes thank you for your explanation mm -hmm. yes and as we move on as we can see here are totally eight kind of dreams option right here yes there are eight options Actually, it's seven kind of hot drinks and one hot water. Yeah, seven kind of hot drinks and one hot water. Mm -hmm. Could you explain what is the seven kind of hot drinks? Of what are they? Of course. Uh, the first one is espresso. Mm, espresso. Right? And the second one is double espresso. Mm -hmm. mm, and then the Americano mm -hmm. and cappuccino and also latte macchiato and uh, also cafe mocha. And uh, hot chocolate, that's the seven kind of hot drinks. I see. Mm -hmm. And as I can see here, it is also with touch screen, uh, touch button design, yes, right? Yes, exactly, yes. You know, actually this is the, a, a, a big whole piece of tempered glass, mm -hmm. right? So, uh, in, order not, in order not to, uh, I mean, just keep this as a whole piece, so that's why we uh, applied touch button for this machine so it's very sensitive you just slightly press it and you can get the drinks very easily I see it's mm -hmm. very sensitive yes and as I can see here is a three arrow size here mm -hmm. that is for that's for uh, that's uh, indicating light for you to dispense hot drinks 
-hmm. when you dispense hot drinks like uh, one of these seven kind, right? And uh, this will show you ah the the cups you can put it here, and the drinks will come out from here. I see. Mm -hmm. And here is a small steam yeah, a sign, small right? Yeah, small right? Yeah. Yeah, that's for the hot water. Mm -hmm. uh, you put the cup here, and when you want some hot water, this will sh the, this light will on. Yes. Uh, I wonder if I can just try one coffee. Okay, no problem. Uh, Wait for a moment. Maybe on that way, Henry, to have some cups. Here. Ah, you can use that cup, bigger cup. Okay. It, I, I get this, this is enough for me. Okay. Okay, I want some cappuccino. Cappuccino, okay. Or this one, latte, latte. Okay. Oh, if we dispense the milk first, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, right now it's dispensing the milk first and then the coffee later. I guess one cup and not enough for the wait no no wait for a moment. It's not finished yet. Yeah. yeah, as you can see, there's double head, double head for the coffee outlet. Ooh. Wow! Sorry, we, we, we uh, use just the wrong use a cup. Wrong, wrong cup, yes. Yeah. So I asked you to use a bigger cup just now. Okay, my fault. Well, but it just very, how to say, the aroma uh, is very attractive, right? Yes. Because. It is uh, the big two cup one. Wait, can you pass us the bigger cup? Tied in a bit. Yes. I just want to try. Okay, just wait for a moment. But this is too hot, I think. You want to share with me? Would you like? Okay. Maybe this one. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Cheers. Wow, it's very. <sighs> wow, tastes very good, you know. Yes, the aroma is very strong, you know. Yeah, it and tastes also, good. Yeah, and also you know the the creamer is very rich. As you can see, I'm not sure if you can, you can see the creamer or not. Yes. It's very rich. Yes. I would like to take more. That's why I like latte, you know. Because I do like the milk. Good. Okay, let's continue, okay? Sorry, but we have to continue. <laughs> As we can see here is the, you know, the, the cup, cup holder. holder. Yes. This That's is for the small cups, right? Yes, just like us, uh, uh, what we do just now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So when, it's, when we want to use large cups, yeah. so we will lift it up, yeah. right? Just lift it up. And put it right it. here, right? Yeah. This time, cup, cappuccino, okay? Or do you want to disband this? Or you no. just want to show? I, I just, I just, okay. I just check it and I guess it, this is enough for me. Oh, okay, okay. Otherwise, you, you cannot sleep tonight. <laughs> right? Yeah. Okay. I guess the whole night will be stand. Okay. Stay up situation. That's, okay. that's a nightmare for me, okay? <laughs> okay. And then we will continue with the drip tray right here. Mm -hmm. As I can see, it is a metal made drip tray, right? Yeah, metal made drip tray. And you know the capacity of this uh, drip tray is 1.5 liter. 1.5 liter? Yes. And uh, what's more, uh, there's a device or a, sensi uh, a sensor inside the machine on the bottom. Mm -hmm. And uh, if you insert this machine, mm -hmm. uh, sorry, insert this drip tray, uh -huh. and then uh, the sensor will, will sense this drip tray and uh, it will, sh it, will sh it, will sh it will show that uh, you can uh, dispense anything normally. Uh, if you take out the drip tray, and it will ask you to put the drip tray back, and then you can dispense normally. So the sensor will warn you to, or just remind you to put back the drip tray. Yes. So that it will work again, right? Yes, absolutely. Okay, and. As we just finish the front mm -hmm. side of this machine, okay. and we will continue with the 
in the side. Yes. As we can see, here is the empty, A but actually it's not empty. Yes. Uh, pin the pin hook part. part. Yes. yes. Okay, just take it out. Yeah, we open the front open door the first. Open the front door first. Yeah, as you can see, the upper the upper part, yes, the upper part of the bean hooper, you can see is this much, but you know, just like a, an ice mountain, right? The the upper part also is very big, so the capacity of this bean hooper is one point two kilogram. Yeah, one point two kilogram. Uh, Chandler, could you please show us the Bin hooper? Yes, of course. Actually, uh, there's a locker here. Uh, yeah. When you uh, it's need a to, locker plate. Yeah, when you need to uh, take this uh, bin hooper out, you can operate like this. So I will drag it. Yeah, drag it, and there's uh, another device that for you to lock this. It's a plastic kit, right? Yeah, to lock the the outlet. To oh, lock yeah. the bin hooper, yes, just to in lock. case the bin will not fall down, right? Yeah, you see, this is the this is the device. Maybe we can show in this way. Okay. Yeah. 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 You're so if smart. We, oh, if sorry. we just take it out. Yeah, you can take it and you see. see. Yes. It's just the hole to dispense the yeah. bins, and when we lock it. Yes. So you see, it's locked. Yeah, and then the the bin will not falling down. Yeah. So, yeah, let me put it back. This is the design for our bin hooper. Yes. Sorry, wait for a moment. Okay. Um, yes. Just like and this. Yes, it is. And under the bin hooper, what we can see? It's our grinder. Yeah, yeah, that's our grinder, mm -hmm. and also the grinder is from Italy. <laughs> <laughs> right, that's why. And may I know what's the brand for the grinder? Actually, it's from uh, Cabernetti, uh, Italy. Yes. Yes. As so far as I know, uh, besides the grinder mm -hmm. as well as the the brewer. brewer, yes, actually the, the brewer. brewing system, right? Yes, the brewer also from. Uh, this company, Comanetic Italy. And also our heating system. Yeah, our heating system also from Italy, but maybe not the same company. Yes, exactly. As you can see here, for most of the parts yeah. are from Italy. That's why we name it. Yes, we name it Aurora. <laughs> Just to remind you that we are it's the specialty of this machine. Yes, yes. Okay, just continue with the grinder. Mm -hmm. Actually, you see the, the grinder, right? And there's an adjustment tool kit. Yeah. Yeah, in the back side. Which, yes. Yeah, which for you to adjust the fi to adjust to finer or rougher powder. Yeah, exactly. Yes. So you can adjust it will grind for finer or cross yes. if you want. And when it dispenses the coffee bean powders, mm -hmm. then it will goes to the it brewer. It goes to, to our brewer, yes. Yeah, it will goes to our brewer, and after it soak and tamp, mm -hmm. and the coffee drink will come out from yeah, this from pie this pie, yes. To here, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. And then you see, actually, we got a double head here when dispensing coffee. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What does it use for? Why we need to design it with double head? Actually, you know, some uh, bean cup coffee machine only use one head, right? Yeah. In if you use double head, yeah, you can get two cups at the same time. If you just place two cups like this. Yeah, yeah I see. Next to them, yeah. So if we will we also have the same design for this one, right? Yes. Wow. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's great. And this device is only just for the espresso? Uh, no. Uh, each, each, I mean, each hot drink, uh, which is coffee based. Also can be dispensed yes. for uh, two cups, right? Yes. For the two hats. Uh, okay. But, uh, but maybe actually it's for espresso or double espresso because for others, like uh, you need uh, hot water or like milk. 
he only dispenses in one pipe. Yes, exactly. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's why I want to ask. Yes. Okay, and as for here, it, this is the mm -hmm. waste bin, right? Yeah, this is the waste bin, yeah. So may I know the capacity of the waste bin? Actually, this waste bin, the capacity is 5 liter. And uh, if calculate, uh, for example, uh, espresso, right? It can make like 200 cups. 200 cups. Yes. Wow, that's impressive. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then we move to the right side of the machine. Yes. As we can see, here is with three canisters. canisters. Mm -hmm. Could you please show our audience about the canisters? Okay, no problem. As you can see, this lid can also can lift, and it's very easy for you to take this out. Yeah. Right. Yes, as you can see, this we got uh this canister. We also use friend, eco friendly and food grade uh, material to made of. Yes. And also, uh, you see, this is the LFGB mark here. I'm not sure if you guys can see that clearly. This one. Yes. And this and this one. F certificate, right? Uh. Yeah, this is the uh, this is the NSF certificate. Mm -hmm. Yes, and maybe you know actually this uh, I mean this canister also is very easy to dispatch and clean inside. Right? Yes, as you can see, as you can, it's very easy to dispatch. Yeah, just twist it, take this out, right? Wow! And yeah, you can clean the inside yeah, very that's easily. Very, it's very convenient, especially for when it's used for commercial use. Yes. You don't need to dispatch, dispatch it with tools, right? Yes. It's only manually by hand. Yes, and also the capacity of this canister is... Uh, 800? Yeah, 800. 800 grand. Yes. Okay. This is three canister, right? Mm -hmm. The first one is for the milk powder, mm -hmm. right? And the second one is for the chocolate powder. Mm -hmm. And the third one is for the cave powder. Yeah, the cave powder. Yes. Uh, can we change the other powder? Uh, yes, if you need like sugar or mm -hmm. tea powder, it can also be placed with this. Okay, mm -hmm. as we can see here, we have two missing bowls. Yes. Uh, for this mixing bowls, we also use uh, friendly, uh, eco-friendly, uh, great mark, uh, great material. Mm -hmm. Yes, and also the mixing motor of this, uh, it's got a very high speed mixing speed, mm -hmm. which is ten thousand and three hundred RPM per minute. Yeah, ten thousand three hundred RPM per minute. Mm -hmm. From which, as you can see, can make very creamy. Yeah. Fold milk fold on top of the coffee drinks as mm -hmm. I showed you before, right? Yes. Okay, and so I can see here is an additional pipe right here. That is for that is for the hot water. Yes, yes. exactly. That is for the separate hot water. Yes. And as I can see here, is also a switch button right here, mm -hmm. on and off. Yes. So we press it on to see what is the main menu for the setting, right? Okay, no problem. Let's close the door. Yeah, just like we mentioned just now, and you can check once you press the uh, setting mode to off, right? And we can check the machine configuration here. Also, you can edit the uh, recipe of the drinks. Yeah, as we can see here, the first one is uh, become, we enter the mode for setting, right? Mm -hmm. And we press it, it shows the... Yeah, the ed editor of the recipe. Yes, this part is majority for the recipe mm -hmm. of the all kind of drinks. Yes. You can choose... Uh, choose... Yes. Or, or adjust it according to this two and another two. Yeah, minus and plus button. Yeah, and another two dots. Mm -hmm. Dots. Okay. Right? Yes. Yes. And as we can see, the second 
menu that is for the sales quantity. Yeah, the drink counter, right? Yes, yes. So. Yeah, if you, you need can, to, yeah, yeah, if you need to check any kind of drink sales quantity or the drink counter, you, you just, just press, press the drink. Like, yeah, like the mocha, right? And right now we dispense one cup. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And okay, to the third one, it the, says the. Is it it the it, uh, water boiler temperature? Yeah, the water boiler temperature. Yes. Next one. Next one is the, you know, actually this is the. A basic, Fasting. yeah, a, a, a basic, a basic temperature that you need to, uh, I mean that that is a false light. Yeah, the yeah. false light. It means when the temperature is lower than then, this one. Yes. The machine will reheat automatically, right? Yeah, reheat automatically. Once your temperature lower than this temp, uh, this temperature, it will not. It, you you cannot dispense anything. Yeah, this is a false button mm -hmm. to make sure. You can have the coffee drinks with the certain temperature as yes. the barista request. Yes. Okay, and the next one, it is the. Uh, it is automatic auto auto cleaning uh, when you switch on the machine. Yeah, it's auto cleaning setting for if you make it to clean automatically. Yes. When for you... every day, you just press it on, right? Yes. Okay, for the next step, and that is the coin that is the function. coin, yeah, the coin yeah. function, yeah, right. Uh, you can connect with the coin function, and you, and then we will have a coin box, yeah, just yes. next to the machine. Yes, exactly. We have this side and additional coin box on the side. Yes. So that it can connect with this bean to cup coffee machine mm -hmm. when this coin function is on. Yes. So you can. Just use it as a vending machine, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, for the next one. That the next one is the language choosing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, right now we is, uh, we will have we have Chinese and English these two languages. Yes, it's for your option for the setting, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, for the next one. For the next one is the calibration mode. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The calibration is needed for each of the into cup yeah. coffee machine, right? Yes. That is a base requirement, I guess. Yes. So this is all for the setting part mm -hmm. for the main menu. Yes. Okay, then we will switch it to the off, off. Mm -hmm. off side. Yes. And here I can see is a red button right here. Mm -hmm. Yes, you know, unlike our other machine, right? Our other machine is uh, a, a green button, which is for cleaning, yeah. But for this machine, we just use this red button as cleaning button. Yes, exactly. Mm -hmm. Just long press for three seconds. Yeah, for mm -hmm. three seconds, it will clean from the missing bowl to yes. the type. Yes. To the pipe automatically. Yes, with hot water. Yeah. Mm -hmm. In this case, it can save your more time, right? Yes. And the labor costs. Yes. For maintenance and. As I can see here is a black and big press button right here. Yes, that's the power, uh, I mean the power button for this machine. To push the machine on or off, right? Yes. Actually, you know, in our other machines, the power button is outside, right? Yeah, for yeah. the normally design, yes. the button will be designed outside of the machine. Yes. But, but why we will design inside? But you know, actually, for this machine mm -hmm. and for the you know for the bean to cup coffee machine, maybe the operating is complicated than other machine. So we will keep the operator who can turn switch on the machine have to. Uh, they they got to use the key to open the door first. Yeah, you then in this you can have the rice yes. for the setting. And all the drops, all the data you want. Yes. If not, in this case, it will, be, it will probably pr protect the owner of this machine, right? Yes. Otherwise, everybody can, uh, you know, edit the machine configuration or the recipe. It will be in chaos, you know? Yes. Okay. And as I can see here, it's a small and black circle right here. Mm -hmm. Okay. This is a, a fuse. 
Yeah, yeah. this is the position the, for the use, right? The fields, yeah. Yeah, yeah, for fields. I yes. know. Mm -hmm. Sorry, just the wrong <laughs> pronunciation. Okay. Okay. And and this part, why we decided inside of here? Also, you know, actually, the fields is for the safety consideration, yes. right? So that's why we also keep it inside. Yeah, if you need to change it, and uh, or you need to unplug it, this guy who has to be who has to uh, have the have right the yeah, to open this door. That's why. And I guess it's very convenient mm -hmm. for the, you know, maybe engineer or somebody else. It's easy to change it from here. Yes. Here is the introduction of this machine. Yes. And Actually, for this machine, uh, you can with the city running water or purified water you can use the pump okay mm -hmm. this, uh, with yes purification water yes okay our own design beam to cup coffee machine mm -hmm. hot are from Italy, right? Yes. And that's why his name is Aurora. 